Now we are doing exercise 3.2 question number 4. Let me write down the question. So solution. The question here the question says so that the points A, B, C, these are the points, are the vertices of an isosceles triangle. So there is an triangle. Okay. Let me name as A B C. Okay. So or I can write down like this also. I think it will be better if I write down like this. A B C. <laughs> you can name it anyway. Okay. A is two comma seven b is 3 comma 0 and c is minus 4 minus 1 something like this okay you have a triangle isosceles triangle now we need to show these points are isosceles triangle so so here a b let us find out a and b right in order to find out a and b a b is equal to root over formula let me write down here so that x1 minus x2 whole square plus y1 minus y2 whole square so we need to find out a b that is x1 is this one y1 is this one and this is x2 and y2 so x1 is 2 minus y x1 minus x2 x2 is 3 2 minus 3 whole square plus y1 that is 7 minus y2 it is 0 and whole square which will be equal to 2 minus 3 it is minus 1 whole square it will be 1 or let me write a minus 1 square plus 7 minus 0 it is 7 square right minus 1 square it is 1 plus 7 7 is 49 49 plus 1 50 so root over 50 we got a b as root over 50 this one right now we need to find out b c okay b c so bc is equal to so bc that is now where is my eraser yeah so x1 y1 and this will be x2 y2 now let us find bc again x1 that is 3 minus 3 minus minus 4 whole square plus 0 y1 minus 0 minus y2 it is minus 1 right so 0 minus minus 1 whole square which will be equal to root over 3 minus into minus plus 3 plus 4 whole square plus 0 minus into minus plus 0 plus 1 it is 1 square so 3 plus 4, 4, 5, 6, 7, square plus 1 square, it is 1, 7, 7 is 49 plus 1 root, which will be equal to root over 50 again. Okay, I hope you can understand. Now, we have found out AB, we, now we have found out BC also, now let us find out AC. So AC will be equal to root over. So, let me rough this one. So let us take a b so x1 y1 and x2 y2 okay fine so a x1 2 minus minus 4 so x1 minus x2 will be 2 minus minus 4 x1 minus x2 whole square plus y1 what is y1 y1 is 7 here 7 minus in minus minus 1 so 7 minus minus 1 and this is also whole square now root over 2 
minus into minus plus 4 whole square plus 7 minus into minus plus 1 whole square which will be 2 4 5 6 6 square plus 7 8 square 6 square it is 6 6 is 36 8 square it is 8 is 64 which will be root over 36 plus 6400 100 root it is 10 now if you look here carefully so let me write down only the right again let me rough this one and let me make you understand what we are doing now so we know we have abc we found out ab to be root 50 bc also root 50 and this one we found out to be 10 right so ab and bc are equal so we are asked to prove isosceles triangle isosceles triangle means any two sides are equal so since ab is equal to bc is equal to root 50 or this 50 i can further classify and write down as 5 root 2 also okay or no need to write down if you are just so since this are equal it triangle abc is an isosceles, isosceles triangle triangle abc is an isosceles triangle triangle and the base that is if these two sides are equal ab and bc are equal then this is your base ac is the base therefore therefore base is equal to ac right ac which will be 10 right and this is your answer that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video